Hey guys, and welcome back to another episode of the Luxury Home Show with Tom and Jazz. Today you're joining us in Islington, London. We're gonna be taking you inside Omaze's newest million pound prize home. It's a four bed, three bath, semi-detached Victorian family home with 3,400 square feet of internal space. It strikes a balance between cutting edge contemporary interiors and more traditional London home features too. Now the best part about entering the draw is that you'll be helping the British Heart Foundation as Amaze are giving 80% of all net proceeds towards supporting their vital work. So what are you waiting for? Hit the link in our bio or pin comment for your chance to win this incredible home. Let's check it out. So a great thing about this property is that it actually has a three car driveway, which is incredible in London, let's admit it. <laughs> We've got this gorgeous red brick with the black features such as the window sills, and it just looks so striking, doesn't it? It's worth three and a quarter million pounds too. So yeah, I can't wait to go inside. Should we go? Let's go. Let's do it. over from Jazz, I'm going to talk you through the ground floor of this property. First, floor plan time. So up that goes, you can look at that. Cool. The first thing that is immediately obvious to me is this really intricate cornicing that you see. Great ceiling heights through here, but I think the first room I'm going to show you is this living space. Got two access points to it, so let's head through. Ooh. And here we are. There's a great balance between new and old. So we've got some real period features in here, such as the cast iron radiators, the cornicing surrounding this room, really intricate detail. And we've even got this ornate marble fireplace here. Ooh. But to really illuminate that contrast, I'm gonna show you these bay windows. At the press of this switch here, they electronically rise, shutting all of that off. I've never wow. actually seen that before. That's really cool. I love the lights in here too. They really highlight the cornicing and the ceiling roses you see. Yeah. And just a perfect spot to sit down on this sofa and enjoy some TV. We've got the TV set into the wall over there. We've got the wide oak flooring through here, which looks stunning. Nice seating area at this end. But we have this central double-sided fireplace here that divides the kitchen and this living space. So, should we head through? Let's go. Cool. The ceiling height is dropped in here, so it feels much more cozy, and that's immediately obvious from this underfloor heating. I can currently feel under my feet. Oh yeah. It's a really nice addition. Got a nice skylight here again, natural light is very important through here. We've got full height glazed bifolding doors at that end of the property as well. Incredible dining space here. Always love amazing interior design. Oh yeah. Yeah, and this property comes fully furnished. So guys, make sure to enter the draw for your chance to win this home exactly as it is right now. Click the link in our bio. Check out this kitchen island as well. Love the marble theme through here. Real sleek and contemporary in comparison to that reception room. Yeah. Loving the two-tone color scheme here. We've got a gas hob here. The extractor fan is set into the ceiling, so no eyesore there. Great sink in here. Check out the size oh my gosh. of these ovens. Two Gaganau ovens in here. So you're, you're set. Massive fridge in here. Then we've got a little ISO as well. Nice, Gaganau. Through here. We have a great utility space, sort of hidden off to the side of the property. Love the colour scheme in here. Again, with that natural light coming in, we've got a skylight here on the roof. Yeah, really convenient spot. It's where your washing machines are. Yes, it's actually worth noting that off the main corridor from the reception room, we do have a downstairs toilet there as yes. well. And an access point behind Jazz in that seating area. There's wine cooler here, wow. I mean. Oh yeah. Filled to the brim. Yeah, so remember that. If you guys. win this, <laughs> this is all yours. <laughs> I won't take any from you. <laughs> Pop that back in there. Will we? Yeah. As I mentioned before, these bifold doors open all the way up to the back. So yeah. I think we should head out and show them the garden. I think this would be so amazing in the summertime, especially when you can just open it up, yes. have all the warm air coming through, not cold. Yeah. <laughs> Absolutely. We've got a great little seating area here in front of this fire pit. You can imagine that being nice and toasty at night. Yeah. We've got the side access down the side of the property there as well. It's a great spot here for some alfresco dining. Let's head on through into the annex. Again, fully bifolding doors that open out into the outdoors. This is set up at the moment as a bit of an office space, yeah. but I can imagine it would work perfectly for a bed as well. You can have a bedroom in here and you'd be set up fully for self-contained living. We've got the kitchen at this end as well. Loving the green splash back in here. 
Oh yeah. Great view towards the back of the property through these windows as well. And through here, we have a bathroom. Loving the tiles. Yeah, those tiles, they're so glossy as well. Yeah, beautiful. We also have aircon in here, which is great. Yes. I can imagine in the summer, this can get quite hot. Oh yeah, yeah, nice to be able to open it out. Let's just have a little look at the back of the property, Jazz. I love the mix between that, the dark features and the brick. It I've always so, been a fan yeah. of that. The architectural profile from here looks so good. That's downstairs. Now we should head up and show the bedroom. So we're going to swap over with Jazz and she can show you those. Let's go, guys. Okay, so we're up on the first floor. I'm going to take you through into our first bedroom. So this bedroom's pretty exceptional. It's actually got a mezzanine kind of study area up there. Great space saver. We'll take you up there in a second, but we've got a nice double bed in the middle. We've got the sash windows overlooking your gardens. And then behind Tom, we have an ensuite too. It's got some really nice tiles in there. I just wanna... Look at how clean it looks. Do you know what? It reminds me of Kim Kardashian's house, a little bit in here. Just yeah. like the clean, like cream tones. Mm -hmm. And then we've got a window there as well, letting in loads of natural light. Should I go up? Yeah, go <laughs> up. I'll follow you. Look how cool these Might steps be a are. Bit precarious Ooh. for yeah. me with the camera, but Ooh. Ooh. I'll give it my best efforts. Look, how cute is this? I can imagine being all cozy up here with the blankets and hot chocolate. Because I don't like coffee. Reading a book. Great spot. But just so Tom can get down easier, we're actually going to meet you back in the hallway. Right, come on out. Nice little step up here. The wood actually changes as well. Come on into the principal suite. Woo! It's so warm in here. I'm loving it right now. But yes, we have this really amazing open plan layout in here with the bathroom. So we'll start over here. I like to think this room is full of statement pieces. So we've got this freestanding bath in the middle. We've got the dual basins over this side and this so seamless, I like how it curves. And we've got the mirror above, the marble splashback on the walls here, which matches the marble here. So it's actually a divider. Behind here is the shower and we've kind of got these dark slate tiles behind here. So it feels really cool in there, I must say. And then we have a marble fireplace here, like the one downstairs windows on this side looking out into your back garden cute little divide i must say i love this seating area that chair yeah it's cool isn't it Very it's a comfy. little bit of me <laughs> yep and then here we have another humongous marble fireplace with the mirror above massive double bed the teal headboard looking really good two sash windows looking out onto the park and cricket field again with the uh, cast iron radiators underneath some yep. great engraving on those and if we come through here we actually have our own walk-in dressing room. It's absolutely huge. Tom's all the way, not even all the way, at the other end. You can see we've got so much space in here and even a little makeup table, your own radiator and your own window. So that's pretty cool, isn't it, Tom? Absolutely. But now I'm gonna take you up to the second floor, final floor, and show you the last few bedrooms. Right, we're on the final floor now. Straight ahead of me, we have the bathroom. We've got the white tiles with the dark granite in between. Looks really striking. We've got the shower as well as a bath and that dark gray flooring. But if we come through here, I'm gonna take you into the first bedroom up here. You can really see the picture of the roof coming through in these rooms. I love all the different angles on the ceilings. It looks incredible. Interior design, once again, love it. With the bed in the middle come through this way we have the last bedroom similar setup to the one in the other room we have a feature wallpaper loads of built-in storage here i like the dark gray we've got once again windows looking out this one's got a view of the park again which is really incredible and then we've got those same heaters up here they just look so cool don't they and this time it's in like a coppery theme yeah you can even see the sort of green coming through which is nice and above your head TV! Gosh, yeah. I didn't know what you're going about. Yeah, so we have a TV that comes down, so when you're sat in bed, you can just click a button and it lowers itself down. Super convenient. Yeah. We hope you guys have enjoyed coming through this house with us. Make sure to head to our Instagram for some behind the scenes of today. It's been a really good day filming. We love coming here and doing Amazes houses, and we hope you do too. So let us know in the comments what your favorite part is, and do not forget to click the link in the pinned comment or description your chance.
to win this home by entering the draw. We'll see you in the next one, guys.